Of course that's how God works, and we just have the imperfect copy of it. <laughs> Some countries are better than perfect copies, but eh. Psalm 85. In Hebrew, text 85, 1 through 13, is numbered 85, 2, 4, 4, 2 through 14. For the director of music, the of the sons of Korah, K O R A H, a psalm. Okay, it's in the book of. Well, I don't think. Probably because whoever gathered this entire book put it together. It's that was a remnant when it was its own thing. Anyway. Then just called it song. Anyway, you Lord showed f the favor in your land. You restored the fortresses of Jacob. You forgave the inquiry of your people. You covered all their sins. The Hebrew has so has e a l a word of answered in meaning here. You set aside all your wrath. You turn from all your fierce anger. Restore us again, God our Savior. Put away your displeasure towards us. Will you be angry with us forever? Will you prolong your anger throughout all generations? Will you not receive us again? That your People may rejoice in you. Show us your unfailing love. Grant us your salvation. I will listen to what God the Lord says. His promises, no, he promises peace to his people, his faithful servants. Be, but let them not turn to folly. Surely his salvation is near those who fear him, that his glory may dwell in our land. Oops, I'm not done. <laughs> Love and faithfulness meet together. Righteousness and peace kiss each other. Faithfulness springs forth from the earth, and righteousness looks down from heaven. The Lord will indeed give what is good, and our land will yield its harvest. Righteousness goes <coughs> before him and prepares the way for his steps. Forty-two. 